Hey everyone, today I wanted to quick show you how to increase the number of attendees that you can have to your LinkedIn events. Um, and more specifically, how to invite people uh, using the connections function through LinkedIn. Um, so when you initially make a LinkedIn event, it asks you to share that uh, as a post on your newsfeed. And what I found, and you probably found as well, is that that post gets almost no reach at all. So very likely you will have very few attendees to your LinkedIn event unless you promote it again in additional posts and videos and send people back to this page. But by far the most effective way that you can get for getting additional attendees to your event is to go in and use this invite function. So um, here's an upcoming event I have in, in two weeks. So what I can do here is go to share and then hit invite. And then it'll pull up all of my first connections, people I'm actually connected to, so not followers, but actual connections on LinkedIn. And then all you have to do is just start clicking their names. Um, and you can see it'll, over here, it'll start having them show up there as you know, people you can invite. Um, and then press the invite button. Uh, and then what they'll then get is a notification. So here's an example that looks like. Um, so this uh, Dana invited me to a business as usual, get ahead of 2024 Planning Now event. Um, so they'll get notified, and you probably experienced this before, they'll get notified via their LinkedIn notifications um, that they can accept or ignore this event. And if they accept it, it'll get prompted to put it in their calendar and they'll get notified um, when you actually start the event too. Uh, so that's a really good way to get in front of your audience. And what's nice about this feature too, is it does allow you to filter a little bit. So you can search by name. So, so if you want to invite someone in particular, so I'll invite my friend Alex, um, I can do this and there's Alex, I can click his name. Um, so if you're looking to invite specific prospects, you can do that. Um, otherwise, it does have the option to uh, do some minor filtering by like location, company, school, location, industry. Although, ideally, you'd want job title, right? You'd want like industry and job title would be ideal, but you can't do it, unfortunately. Um, but if you can find some ways to work around that based on industry, like let's say I'm, I know that a lot of my customers are in the IT services and consulting fields. So I can I can narrow it down that way and I can find some people to invite that way. So that's one way of doing it too. Um, and then when you're actually ready to invite people, you press that invite button, off it goes, and then they'll get that notification again uh, that'll show up in their mind network where they can go in and accept or ignore that. So um, that's, I just wanted to show you that quickly today because it is a really, really important way of getting people to attend your LinkedIn events. I see a lot of people that use LinkedIn events but fail to actually invite people to it. So they might only have like five, 10 people registered to it, where if you have a good connection list and you have a good network, you might as well leverage that uh, and use that manual invite function. So hope that helps for your next event.